I went past this booth and this woman had on this shawl. I'm gonna put, I have video footage of that too. It's called the Crazy Bird Shawl. I bought two copies of the pattern, one for me and one for my bestie. Um, I, I don't know that you can see this well, but you'll see it in the video on her. Had to have it. It is absolutely, okay, so now you gotta turn, you gotta model for me. Come on, come on, turn around, turn around, turn around. That is so nice, and it's really just like a wrap, if you will, right? No sleeves, that's just drop stitches. Just drop stitches. It's about six hours of TV knitting in that. What weight yarn is that? I absolutely adore that. I bought yarn too. I bought this. She had pretty um, chunky yarn. So I got this. Um, it's called Plush Bulky. And the color is called Golden Rod 2. Can you guys see the hues and how the color kind of ebbs and flow in there? I got two skeins of that. I know, I know. Then I wish you guys could touch and feel. This is 100% Angora. And you had to see the things that they had made with it. It had this like halo or this hue. And I was like a nice little scarf. And then when you fancy and dressing up. So I got those two. And what else? The woman there is called Wendy Clay Pottery. Again, I'll put all the websites and everything up. But she does these buttons by hand. Look at that. Of course, I had to get something purple for my Shelby. And I got this one. So, I don't know what I'm going to put them on. But I had to get them. They were really nice. And a decent price, too. So, I had to get them. So, I really enjoyed my um, cozy. I got to meet some nice folks. You know, like-minded fiber lovers. This is my first time going. Apparently it's an annual thing and I will definitely go again. I really enjoyed myself. There was, well you'll see the footage in the video, this one woman that hand dyed these. Okay guys, if you didn't read my post and you chose not to come, shame on you. I'm not sharing anything. Oh, look at that purple. My baby loves purple. Okay, wait, we gotta look at that. Silk scarves, they were, it was just beautiful. You know, it just amazes me, the things that people come up. There was folks there actually um, weaving material. As I was walking out, a man stopped me, showing me how you spin yarn with the spindles, because he makes the wooden spindles. So it was just a day full of crafty, creative people, and I truly enjoyed myself. So I hope you enjoyed my haul um, and of course as I use my newfound yarn and make things with them I will absolutely share.